The summer after my freshman year, I was able to do research with Howard Zebker here in the geophysics department. And as part of doing that summer research, um, I was able to go to the American Geophysical Union fall meeting, which happens in San Francisco every December and is the biggest gathering of earth scientists in the world. And it's a really inspiring and active place to sort of see science in action. I was just a little freshman, didn't really know sort of what the full breadth of earth sciences was, but I went to that conference and went to a bunch of the different keynote talks. One of the keynote talks that I went to at the AGU meeting was Susan Solomon's keynote talk. Her talk was about climate science in general and about the role of science in society and the place that scientists could take in helping society understand its place in on the earth and in the universe in general. And that was something that I found incredibly motivating. NASA and NOAA had these postcards that they were giving away. So I took a postcard, flipped it over and wrote a note to Simon on the back of it that said, I went to Susan Solomon's talk and now I want to be a climate scientist. And I mailed it off to him. And the next year I did a research project in climate science and I've been working on that ever since. So now I am a graduate student at Princeton in their program in atmospheric and oceanic sciences and I'm in the fifth year of my PhD there. Right now I'm hoping to continue studying some of the questions that I'm studying right now. So stay um, focused on climate science and looking at how uh, human activities affect the climate system. Um, I plan to do that through a postdoc position, so doing some more independent research within a university or institution, and then hopefully one day being a professor myself.